So one of the add-ons in Laravel Zero is called Notify. And this is actually installed by default. You no longer need to include it in. And this allows us to send desktop notifications from our command line application. So let's just open up one of our current commands and add this functionality in. So I'm just going to come under app commands, INI command. And then under our handle method, what we can do is we can call this notify. And then the notify method can take in three arguments. So it can take in a notification title. So for the title, we could say PHP INI file. And then a more detailed description is the second parameter. So we can say your PHP INI details are now displayed in the terminal. And then the third and final parameter, and again, these are optional, but you can send a custom image to the notification area. So under my root of the application, I've just created an images folder and put a logo and put my penguin logo in there. So I'm just going to add this in as a third parameter and that's under images logo.png. Now let's call this command. So php penguin ini and I've hit enter. We should see the notification drop down from the top of the screen. And there you can see the php ini file which is the title, the first parameter. The description of it is the second parameter and the third parameter is the actual penguin logo. Now these are all different on depending on your system. Uh, so I'm on Linux with GNOME, but this will obviously look different on Windows and Mac, but they all work the same way. So that kind of feedback in the notifications is good if you're running a command that is going to last a while. So after the command has run, so say you were parsing some error logs or making requests to a website and it could take a couple of minutes, the user can put the terminal in the background and wait for the notification to say the task has been completed. So it's a nice little uh, trick to keep your users notified on the progress of the application. Just something to note on the um, actual images, they do not get packaged up into the build. So what we need to do is copy our images folder into the build folder. And when you distribute your application, you need to distribute them together. Otherwise, the image will not show in the notification.